Hi Capricorn. Your tarot cards reading by M. For the first half of March, the first two weeks in March, first till the 15th, okay? And there's five of pentacles, two of swords, influenced by eight of swords, okay? So five of pentacles paired with five of swords. Two of swords with the hierophant. Um, I think it's problem perhaps with money, lack of something definitely, lack of support, maybe problem with people, disagreements with people, maybe some gossip, maybe you have expected that you know, you did have maybe some project and you're supposed to do something, you did have some negotiations and you have expected that someone or some people will stand by you. You needed support, okay, and you didn't get. And obviously you were at loss here, first week of um, March, you feel that you lost. Not because you were at fault, but because you were left alone, you were betrayed. This is betrayal here, that's why you feel so bad. Maybe you lost some money, maybe some project couldn't finish, but definitely you were disappointed, very, very disappointed here. First week of March, because of other people letting you down. Perhaps you don't want to even talk about that, you kind of got stuck because of that. You kind of felt stuck perhaps even from earlier on with something which you are doing forever and perhaps you felt that you cannot do it, you cannot carry on unless somebody gives you two hands. You felt that you were not capable to carry this burden, this um, difficulties to carry it any longer. You cannot do it by yourself. You felt weak, stuck in the situation uh, with no way out. You cannot finish you cannot complete it you put lots of effort and nothing happens you see what I'm saying in that sense kind of tough energy for you and it seems that there was nobody down there at least there was not that one you have expected to help you okay that one didn't come up with goods, didn't show up, didn't do what they're supposed to or what you have expected to. Now, second week doesn't get better, doesn't get clearer. You will be thinking about this, okay? It's kind of no clear answer for you right now. Whatever that has happened, okay, um, you have expected somebody to help you because you were stuck with a difficult, I don't know, project, difficult life, difficult situation, financial health-wise or something, you were in a difficult position and you maybe asked for help or you didn't ask but you have expected, but help you didn't get. Um, I mean, still you don't know what to do, still you don't have answer for yourself what to do now. You cannot even talk about your problems now, you cannot even bring it up. You all the time kind of you feel that people are sabotaging you. You, you can do nothing. You cannot decide. You, you cannot move. There, there's no movement for you. There's no visibility for you. Like, like you're scared of people around you, maybe colleagues at work. And it seems like uh, whatever that you do, you've got somebody behind your back trying to sabotage you, trying to stab you in the back, saying mean things, ugly things. Um, and you were afraid. No way out, no visibility. At least you will not be talking about that. Look, I like this energy within you, Capricorn. Very solid, Taurian energy, decisive. This is knowledge, this is intelligence, this is abilities. You see what I'm saying? This is faith, believing in, believing in yourself, in, in something which you can. I really like to see now this one um, within you. Believing in yourself, in your abilities, in, uh, um, in people around you again, but a different group. Not these, uh, not these people in your office, but your family. Maybe you do have your family around you, supporting you, but you surely do have 
support. Surely you do have something which you can rely on. And we were talking group of people, um, your spouse. You can rely on somebody to tell you, don't worry. It's all right. It will be all right with the time. I mean, the Hierophant always talks about something which will come with time. Just believe in it. Trust yourself. Don't lose your faith. It will happen. But you're not talking about that. Surely two of swords, kind of very bad experience. I kind of feel that you do have some bad experience with people. When you needed them, you relied on them and they did let you down. Now you are relying on yourself. You are still very faithful. That what is on your mind, that what you are after, that what you are destined to do or you want to do, you will manage. It will happen for you. But you were very careful this time not to reveal anything. Because kind of as soon as you reveal what you want, what you are after, you've got people sabotaging you. Okay, you don't have help, but you've got people toxic around you trying to um, do some harm to sabotage you or so. Lovely to have this within yourself. Maybe there is somebody who is advising you, but being that this energy is within you, I kind of feel it's you, Capricorn, you, solid self. You found courage, you found your beliefs, your faith. You found your faith in your future, in yourself, in people around you. Not all of them are bad. Some of them reveal themselves as enemies. But there are other people and they can stand by you. They can help you later if you need. So it's, it, is, so it is important for you right now, second week of March, not to talk about what you believe in, what you are after next. It's very important to keep it quiet. So these toxic people, these enemies, they will not know what you are after. It's very important. So they cannot harm you. It's important to keep quiet. Not really pleasant these two weeks for you Capricorn. I'm really sorry. I actually did have quite lovely this uh, part of March these two weeks almost for all signs. Now you are coming with these swords, these fears, this uh, I don't know, uh, mean people around you. Definitely somebody did let you down, okay? But you were standing strong. I mean, you do believe in yourself. What you were after, you will go after it. It's just that this time you will be very careful who you're going to trust. Anyway, Capricorn, that's all from me for now. I will surely speak to you again about second half of this month. Um, but till then, best regards. Thereby, I am.